Hey guys, Sarah here with iOS app lists, and for this review we're taking a look at Opicop, which is a really fun iPhone game that's also available on iPad. Opicop can be downloaded from the App Store for free, and it's universal, and it's kind of like an arcade game uh, with a bit of a frustrating flappy bird-like twist. Uh, it's really fun to play, and I had a blast reviewing it. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the main screen of Opicop, which is this. You can see there are different buttons, and graphics are pretty basic. You can adjust the difficulty settings here on the left. You can adjust the speed at which the helicopter moves. The needle goes all the way to the right. Uh, helicopter moves faster. And to play, tap the helicopter and pick a checkpoint. And the weird thing about Opicop is the controls take a lot of time to get used to. In order to move the helicopter left, you tap the right side of the screen. In order to move it right, you tap the left side of the screen. And as you see here, there are stars that you can collect. And stars contribute to points, and as you reach uh, further up the map, they're score. worth more. Score. If you hit an obstacle, the game is over. So your total score is calculated, and you have an option of sharing your score with the rest of the world, but you can also toggle your sound if you so choose, which is handy if you don't want to have the helicopter sounds. There's also an in-game shop in Opicop, and you see here you can purchase stars, you can get additional lives, you can also disable ads if you need to. Personally, I don't think the ads really get in the way. They can be annoying, but you have the option at least of disabling them. So just to demonstrate increasing the speed of the helicopter, we'll go ahead and you see here you can access checkpoints if you haven't reached them yet, but this is the highest difficulty mode. So you have to collect stars as quickly as you can. And you can see there is quite a bit of difference between slow motion or the slow mode and fast mode. Much harder takes you bit more time to uh, get used to it. And you see Opicop also features full screen ads along with the permanent banner at the bottom of the screen. It's also a really helpful uh, help page that gives you an overview of everything about Opicop. And that is one thing I noticed about the game. There isn't a tutorial or anything. Being that the buttons aren't very descriptive on the main screen, it does take a uh, bit of trying to figure out what stuff does, but the best part about Opicop is the fact that it's really easy to pick up and play, but it's incredibly difficult to master. One thing I do like is the graphics are pretty basic, the concept is basic, controls are simple. You can swipe down on the screen a couple of times and it will automatically pause the game if you need to pause it for some reason. Again, Opicop is available to download from the App Store for free and is universally compatible with iPhone and iPad. If you enjoyed this, be sure to subscribe, like, leave a comment, and check us out at iosapplists.com.